Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Mile High Collector here. Uh, today we've got a couple of uh, blasters of a the newest uh, NBA product from Panini 2023-24 Select uh, Basketball Retail. Obviously, um, Select used to be, I guess in some respects, still is one of the higher end products uh, that Panini puts out. I guess mid-high products. Um, but the last couple years with the NBA, they've done a retail um, version. Um, to be honest, I haven't been super impressed with it in the past. Um, doesn't hold a tremendous amount of value. Um, but you know, with, with Wembiana in, in the, in the, the hunt now, these, these, I guess, potentially hold a little more value. So I wanted to give them a try. So, uh, before we get started, uh, if you wouldn't mind, uh, like the video, comment down below and subscribe to the channel. That will help me grow the channel. Um, we will be taking a look at both of these today. Uh, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Um, Comment down below, let me know uh, if you have opened Select this year or in the past, and if you have kind of what your impression has been. Again, I, I, I the card design is great. It just, there doesn't seem to be a tremendous amount of value um, on the resale market. Now, just before we get in here, obviously there, you do have the opportunity to pull, to pull the Tiger and Zebra Prisms, which are pretty coveted um, out of the retail product. They also have the retail base mezzanine level, and uh, prisms, and then if you see the odds here on the side, there are quite a few uh, numbered parallels that you can pull um, from the retail product. So I don't believe there is. There are some um, autographs that you can pull out of here as well. I, I, I assume those are very difficult to pull out of retail, especially out of the blaster format. But anyway, we'll give it a try. Give it a try. Six packs, four cards per pack, so twenty-four cards. So it should be a relatively uh, quick rip. So appreciate you checking out the channel, and we'll go ahead and, and get right into it. Okay, so NBA playoffs in full swing. Obviously, as a Nuggets fan, uh, they put the Lakers down to three games to none last night. They are in the driver's seat handily in that series, so hopefully Saturday night they can finish it off. So here's the card design. Obviously, this is their, their, the, the blue uh, indicates it's the retail um, version of the card, similar to what uh, it was last year. Um, first look, this is literally the first time I've seen these cards. I haven't seen any open online. So um, card art. The cards look a little dark with that dark blue, but um, we'll see. We'll see how they how they how they uh, finish up. So there's Bradley Beal, Shaden Sharp, first rookie Brandon Miller. That's a good one. Here's the back of the card. Pretty standard select uh, design. That's the concourse level. For those who haven't opened um, much select, there are different levels of the card. Uh, this is a good look at one here. This is the I believe the um, court side, and that is one of the prisms. So um, Michael Bridges on the courtside prism, pretty good looking card. So yeah, so uh, let me know what you think of the card design. I think it's again the the blue um, retail blue. I don't love it. I, I mean, maybe it's a good color match for some teams. There's Jaw, um, but it's it's overall just it, it's a pretty dark card design this year. Um, the photography just I, mean, I don't know the backgrounds don't pop. I know that Select doesn't always have. Um, there's Luca, so that'd be you know a nice color match type card there if it was one of the parallels and then our first insert neon icon uh Koulibaly rookie it's a pretty cool looking card so I like that yeah so that's you know that's a pretty nice insert design so not bad going on to our third pack here it's, uh, okay Veznikov not familiar with him but that's a rookie there's Kwai Giannis and looks like we've got color here. Orange, I don't believe are numbered, but let's take a look here. We've got Bam Adebayo for the Heat. Beautiful card. There's a lot going on there. Almost looks like it's miscut, maybe. Am I crazy? No, it's just the, something about the, the design on that one that made it look kind of weird. So that must be the orange. Um, not exactly sure what that's called, but yeah, there's something. I don't know if that's just me that's catching the eye that makes it look like the card is almost... Um, miscut, but I don't think it is. So anyway, first piece of color, not too bad. Again, I don't know that we've got anything sleeve worthy yet, but we're still young in the pack. So let's see what we have. There's Chris Murray, rookie, Cam Thomas, Julius Randle, and looks like got a, oh, great, awesome, Jamal Murray. So on the green, um, I think it's a green and white purple parallel. Don't believe that's numbered as well, but I'll, I'll take a, a Jamal Murray any day of the week. 
He has um, hit that, obviously, that game-winning shot over Anthony Davis in game two. Not not playing or not shooting his best, but he's still, uh, you know, I think scoring more than 20 points a game and really contributing to the Nuggets' playoff run uh, so far. So I hope to see big, bigger things from him as we close out the Lakers series and move on to round two, hopefully. So Paul George, there's Kobe Brown, rookie. Sengun on the, I think this is a course. Let's see what we got in the back here. So there's another Brandon Miller. There's a silver, so that's not a bad card. I know he's one of the the higher rated rookies. Let's go ahead and sleeve that one up. That's probably our first sleeve worthy in the silver. So those look great. I, those as opposed to the dark blue. So that's a silver concourse. I, I, I like that card design a lot. So that looks really nice. We'll go ahead and top load that, but anyway. Those look really great. And then going back to the Sangoon, that's the court side as well. And this is the non-prism. So not bad. Okay, last pack out of the first blaster. Thanks for, for checking around, us out and hanging out. Um, got some more videos coming up, some more Heritage Baseball, some mail day pickups, and then some uh, PSA submission cards to share with you. Uh, so, so appreciate you checking back on the channel. Cave Cunningham, there's a DeAndre Ayton, and we got another orange looks like. LeBron himself. So again, not too bad if you're going to get, um, you know, a uh, parallel. The big biggest names are always the best. So there's LeBron currently has his hands full with my nuggets. But anyway, okay. So overall, not too bad. I'd say obviously nothing super, super exciting there, but um, we'll see what we get out of this, this next blaster. Um, so far, I think the, the Brandon Miller silver and then that Jamal Murray and then the LeBron are probably the... Uh, the best hit so far. So let's see what blaster number two holds. This product, I think, just came out recently on Target's website. I just got these delivered last night. So haven't seen a ton of this in the wild yet. Nick Smith Jr. rookie. There's an Osur Thompson, and we've got a Devin Vassell um, prism on the back. This is the mezzanine. So this must be, I think, the the exclusive uh, mezzanine. So that's not a bad rookie card there. And then, like I said, here is the um, base blue prism. Next pack. Let me know down below, who do you guys root for uh, in the NBA? Do you, is your team in the playoffs? If so, how are they doing? There's Joel Embiid. They, they won it last night over the Knicks. So followed up by his teammate, Tyrese Maxey. Who's been playing well? I guess got some more color on the background here. Maybe just a an insert. Uh, select certified. So this is one of the inserts. So those that's a great looking card. So that's uh, Embiid select certified insert. Really like that. Might go ahead and sleeve that one up. I don't know that it's a hugely valuable um, insert. We'll check here at the end of the video to see if that's something that is um, shorter printed, but definitely a nice insert there. So I like that. Yeah, let me know if you have a team in the playoffs, how they're faring. Um, exciting time, ton going on. The, the NFL draft was last night. Uh, Broncos selected Bo Nix at 12, which is a bit of a reach, I think. I'm excited that uh, Scoot Henderson, so there's another one of the top rookies, excited for for him in Denver, but uh, hopefully he he proves himself worthy of that that high of a pick and and he brings, brings the energy back to the Mile High City. So Holmgren... Kulabali rookie, and then we've got the Nick Smith Jr. on the premier level with the orange, um, the orange parallel. So, yeah, good, good looking cards. Like I said, if you can get one of the tiger or the zebra prisms, I think that's probably your your chase card in the uh, in the product. Still looking for a Victor rookie, but uh, not seeing it yet. Anthony Black rookie, Kyrie. And then we have a Ben Shepard, uh, green, white, and purple on the premier level. Another good-looking rookie card. Two packs to go. Let's see if we can get anything big out of here. Numbered card would be great. A Victor would be great. We got Shea, Case and Wallace rookie, Clay Thompson, and then a Zach Levine prism. Blue prism. Okay. And last pack, let's see if we can make up for it here. And then I'll let you know my overall thoughts. You can probably guess them. Just seeing what we pulled out here. Trey Young, 
Aiton, there's a Grady Dick, and then Damian Lillard, orange on the back, and that Grady Dick is the premier level base, I believe. So, okay, so overall, about what I expected. Um, pretty typical of select basketball. I, I doubt I will be ripping any more of this, maybe one blast or more. Um, you know, biggest hit, if you want to call it that, is probably this Brandon Miller silver um, uh, concourse level. It's a nice card. And then the select certified insert, and then just for the PC, Jamal Murray, uh, green, white, and purple. So overall, I would say um, it, it is it, select retail basketball is who we thought it is. It is, you know. It's an okay product. Um, if you you're ha you get lucky and hit one of the bigger rookies, maybe there's some value. Otherwise, um, it is it is a pretty vanilla set. So I would say proceed at your own caution. Um, but anyway, hopefully, if if watching me open these saves you a few bucks to maybe just buy singles instead, then then I will consider that a, a victory for all of us. So anyway, appreciate you checking out the video. Uh, like I said, please like the video, comment down below with maybe what your favorite pull was or what you think of the product, uh, and subscribe to the channel for more videos coming soon. Otherwise, I appreciate you checking us out, and we'll catch you on the next one. Take care.